What's up, YouTube? Hope y'all doing good. Uh, today I'm in Dubai. I decided to bring back the regular tutorial. So every Saturday I'll do a regular tutorial, just me and FL Studio explaining something in a simple way, easy to follow along, and just, I don't know, just wanted to give you guys a lot more value by doing these easy to follow tutorial. So today we're going to try and make a Mr. Rage type melody and just type beat with using stock plugins only. So the plugin I'm going to be using is Citrus, which should be free with any FL Studio version. So it's right here. And uh, I found this cool preset called, uh, uh, what was it? Austrian accordion. Uh, that sounds kind of like, it's, it's got good, like it's a good sound for like Playboy Cardi type melody so we're gonna try and create uh this melody first and then we're gonna make it sound more like mr rage by adding some overdrive and and extra stuff to make it sound more like that track so hey if you guys enjoy follow my instagram at you to the z i'm giving away uh, a fl studio recording template when we reach 100k that's pretty soon so go and follow me and hey much love let's go so let's go over to the piano roll uh, maybe let's select like 150 BPM. First thing we want to do is just find some cool chords that will go fire with this type of melody. Okay, so I'm just playing around on my keyboard here till I find something I like. Uh, I got this right now. And I already know the second chord in my head, but uh, I can't play it on the actual like keyboard of my laptop. So I'm just go ahead and um, like record the first part here uh. yeah that's it so now we're gonna quantize that so command a alt q to quantize and then let's try to make sure all of these are the perfect length so let's drag these out and then just cut them like this so we got this right now and now we need to find the second chord so i want to go with i want it to go so that's the bass note So now that we got this, I feel like it might sound better if, you, if this is the first uh, chord. So let's just move it like this. I should, I forgot this one. Hold on. So now we got this. Let's put it to a mixer channel. Uh, that's Command L. And uh, let's first put a soft clip on the master and set up this limiter uh, like this. Bow. And right now it's already like it's fire, but it's not like the Mr. Rage type vibe yet. So we're gonna just turn down the bass here and add blood overdrive. Before you do this, headphone users, watch out. Just <laughs> turn on the post gain first because it will literally break your ears if you don't do this first. Uh, and now you just turn up the preamp. Color the sound a little bit. It's too much like this. Something like that sounds, sounds fire. Uh, let me just maybe EQ it a little bit or maybe put like a isotope vinyl on it so it sounds a little bit more uh, retro. Make sure you turn down the dust. Vinyl, vinyl is a free plugin, by the way. Maybe we can add some kind of 
little extra pad in the background. Let's check Citrus out as well. Put back the keyboard here. Wow, this super fire sound. So this sound is spring. I don't know exactly in which category it is, but you know, I'm telling you all the sound should be enough. Wow, fire. So let's uh, command B. Uh, yeah, like this. So what I did here is I respected the bass note of the, this is the bass note. Let's put a little bit more to the backgrounds because it's kind of, it's kind of super present. Let's put a little gross beat on here, which is also a stock plugin. Hey bro, stock plugins is fire, bro. Let me just, uh, let me just uh, put a little rewind here. super fire all right let me use my drum kit uh using the secret sauce kit by checky beats the link will be in the description down below uh but use any 808 that you want uh but i'm going to use my spill 808 here uh and then one of my clubs right here this one will be fire and then let's use uh my sauce hi-hat and that should be about it. So let's just two step the hi hat, put in the clap like this. Uh, so let's make sure that the entire pattern is selected. Like this, bow. <laughs> I feel like this needs a different hi hat. Let me um, let me take a hi hat out of a different kit. I like this hi hat right here. Uh, shout out Cash Money AP. Yes, sir. So on amidst the rage type beat, the 808 is kind of really saturated so what we're going to do is go over to the boost knob here and just boost it a little bit make sure your uh, soft clipper is on the master channel or else you'll have some issues <laughs> clipping your sound so now with the 808 we're just going to be simple and respect the bass notes again so this is going to be our first obviously an octave lower but Just copy that, select it all, octave down, and then. The spring melody is a little bit too loud, so let me. Just Remove this gross beat. Maybe 
it, it'll sound even more fire if you drop it down a little bit. Uh, maybe like one, two, three. So we'll go over to the melody as well. One, two, three, and then to the bass as well. And that will sound a little bit more low. It's fire, bro. Hey, um, so yeah, structure would you know go a little bit like if you want to mimic the Mr. Rage type structure, you'll go like this, uh, and you make the beat drop here and just go like this. <laughs> That's basically it bro, hope you guys enjoyed this simple tutorial uh, with stock plugins. Let me know if there's anything else that you, um, that you like to, you know, that you like to know or that you want to, you know, learn in a tutorial. Let me know in the comments down below. Definitely go and follow me on IG and check out my latest single Kufofe videos on my channel. Much love. Take care. Peace.